réussir, il finalise tout the way. What shall we start the car Make sure to get it sent to day. Ok, sir. Yes. Got a question for you. What's heavier? A kilogram of Trustmaster or a kilogram of Tabardo? Oh, come on. God damn it! Damn, boy, he did! Over the past couple of years, I've always been a firm believer of using controls. The reasoning is simple. Why buy one big boy when you can buy an Azulane Prince Eugene 1x7 minifigure? So I've been solely using the PS4 controller for the past 3 years and nothing else. But times have changed and recording waifu videos is never the same again. So I thought to myself, what could be more expensive, more cancerous, most artistic than buying minifigures? Salty users, <laughs> single drivers, <laughs> Chad Sheeran, yes. and ultra realistic oh. feedback. This is sim racing. Um, is it that? Oh the main point of a controller this big is, of course, to play games. It's me! Of course, the obvious one are these, 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 but this channel is different. So, I'm going to be playing all the recent games from my library, which I've probably made videos on. With that being said, let's start now. Wait, uh, wrong video. Hey, 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 hey. This one. You might be questioning now, that's a trash can. Well, it is, because it's a crew 2 and a 4 speed heat. The second question is, of course, why are these games in your trash? Well, there's a common rule of thumb where you can decide if the games is good or not after 3 episodes. And these clearly haven't passed that. Quick mess. So, the real question is, will a wheel revive my love for these games? I wanna die. It's shit. Hey folks, <laughs> They messed up badly. Okay, I need you to imagine you controlling a controller. That's escape. Yeet! <laughs> How about my most played game, Forza Horizon 4? A simple game where you don't know when you'll be getting 200 wheel spins, or getting outright banned, even being the most popular YouTuber. It's quite a mess, but it's a good mess, and I've been playing it since. With a wheel, however, it's, it's fine. Instead of the trashman right back there, Forza cuts the middleman and directs the control to the car right away. But it's still not good. At the end of the day, Forza is made for normies. An acronym for normal people or Russian mafias interested in esports. You can't really expect the Russian mafias to, you know, own a steering wheel. So, the developers cater the physics towards controllers. I mean, steering wheel adds feedback to the game, but it's still Forza Horizon 4. As Hokio Shield say, and give you guys a summary, at the end of the day, I don't really think a wheel is worth it just for Horizon. But what games are good for a wheel? Arcade games are probably one of the first places where I find a steering wheel in a game. And that is where Need for Speed and the Creatures Physics comes from. But they clearly failed in the steering wheel department, so how about real arcades? But the outset, you're in lockdown. You can't get to an arcade store. Yes, I can't go outside. Emulator goes. Oh, wait, I forgot to. If it weren't for some emulator issues, it would have been the perfect game for racing wheels. Um, where's the console really? So many people can't, can't have access to it. Like, come on, just release it for the PS4 or some shit. Initial D and one minute maximum tune shows that arcade physics doesn't have to use a controller always. You can use steel wheel in these type of games, and it will be as fun if it's implemented correctly. Hell, I think it's better for you to just 
straight out play using a steering wheel because the experience is so much better. No, it's not in. Okay, so what? Oh, Jesus, no. These games are the games which I'm afraid of because when you're using a controller, it doesn't add a lot more oomph in the simulator. You need a proper racing wheel. So, what are the first games which I try? BMG. BMG is special for me because it teaches me how to drive an actual manual. And with BMG, I learn how to do manual without actually burning up a clutch. That's probably one of the greatest features of BMG. It's damage simulation. When you're not using the clutch, the transmission grinds. When you're not on bumps, the bumper falls off. When you crash into a wall, the metal goes... <laughs> Well, it's still not the best because this game does have funky force feedback and there is no multiplayer. Oh my god. These guys brought BeamNG to a whole other level because they added multiplayer, a feature which I really needed because I don't have friends. So now I can finally have friends by ramming people. So, with all those games behind, what is probably the best game for racing wheel? Well, in terms of cars, track, physics, graphics, Project Cars 2 and Gran Turismo is probably at the top of the list. Unlike Gran Turismo, however, Project Cars 2 can run on this, and that is an advantage because I do not have any money for a PS4 despite having a game. Project Cars 2 graphics are great, the car library are massive, the physics is wonderful and the maps are plenty. But there's just one problem. You can't buy an age shifter. And oh, there goes the game. And probably the last game in this list is Set of Corsa. It sucks. Project Cars 2 in general is far more superior than this old game, which was left by his own dad like our own dad. I mean, he's left for 3 years where his dad has a new daughter with cool flex and tick bombs. And like that single kid in your local area, of course, the Arara will be coming, offering those mmm, crispy graphics. And a set of Corsa has something which a set of Corsa competition, I say, doesn't have. A set of Corsa has free roam maps. I mean, it's not official, and you have to doubt some mods, for example, this, which is Shito, and has high horsepower cars which is uncontrollable. One thing I learned from a set of Corsa mostly is that people get sim racing rigs for experience. It's not really realistic at most of the cases, but the driving thrill is still there. You don't have to think about the risk, you don't have to think about anything, you just drive. And even possibly, WrestleMania. <laughs>